What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the weekly bracket, we, boys. We back in it, baby. Once again, this week. Welcome, FGC peeps, Smash peeps. It's your boy Banjo. Chaos Overdrive. And it's nice to have everybody back here, man. Weekly bracket. You know we got the tournament updates for you guys for this week. So we about to get into that right meow. Let's see the week and see what we got going on, guys. So this Tuesday, right, today, we have the cloud up there in spring. Miko will not be joining us. That man is actually on his way to CEO Taku. So. Oh, yeah, that boy got things to do. But, I mean, uh, in replace, that mean, they still playing, though. Yeah, so of you course. can go get some Dragon Ball in. You can get some Tekken 7. You definitely need that practice because we got big things coming in later on in the week. So uh, if you can make it out there or if you're already in that area, definitely make sure to stop by and show them boys some love, even though Miko ain't done. Shout-outs to him going out to CEO Taco this weekend. But, yeah, they're still having it today. Don't forget it. Yeah, don't forget, guys. 3 o'clock is when the casuals start. If it gets competitive around 7, if they have enough numbers, it will turn competitive. You got $3 venue for $2 entry. So the cloud in spring, check them out today if you guys got time. But tomorrow is the good old, the oh my gogi special. Yo. Korean style tacos. The del day. The, de boy. the deliciousness. Aside from that, it's Windburn Wednesdays, y'all. And, you know, we got the Project M, we got the Tekken 7, and once again, we have the DBFC. So, got to grind that out. And don't forget, it's only $3 venue and $2 entry. And uh, this also, uh, we will be running another raffle. We got about 155 in the pot going towards the uh, Madden Relief Fund. Uh, you know, bless those people. But, um, uh, we're still sending out more money to them. We're going to have another raffle as well. So even if you don't come out for the games, come out and hang out. Participate in the raffle. Help us send a bigger spirit bomb than what we already got going on, man, to try and provide some relief to those people. For sure. Wimburn Wednesday is always just like a, a super, like, homey environment. You know, you got drinks, you got food, you got games. So there ain't nothing better, really. Really, really dope. And then um, Thursday, we'll be skipping Thursday for, you know, once again, we have major reasons going on this weekend. But – uh, on Friday, we're going to have, you know, yet our casual U of H crowd once again, and that's bring your own console, that's bring out your buddies, play whatever you want. And I do believe grind breaks like that, right, Benjo? Yeah, grind break, you got the casuals going in from 4 to 7, but uh, like the cloud, we'll make it competitive around from 7 to midnight, you know what I'm saying? But the bring your own console, is just so happens to be like, it's actual bring your own console. So, I mean, if you happen to bring... You know, vampire savior, and there's <laughs> and there's and there's thirty people here, and then it's like, all right, well, I guess we're gonna run vampire savior for tonight. So, yo, I'm down. Low. Let's get it, <laughs> let's get it cracking, guys. Honestly, you know, and uh, the tournament, if they run the tournament, whatever game it may be, it runs from seven to midnight. Venue five bucks. I wouldn't stay out too late though. Cause uh, Saturday, I believe we got Saturday, Space City beat down. This is where the Boy. big this is where the big boys come out to play, right? So we got third strike. Street Fighter Third Strike is going to be uh, a game played here on Saturday for Space City Beatdown. And, of course, we have the usuals, Street Fighter, Tekken 7, Dragon cross Ball Fighter C, and Cross Tag, baby. Yo, that's my game. So, Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battles. So, for the anime people, for the anime people, this is your chance to come up. Because a couple of the big, you know, anime fighters, uh, anime players, they're not going to be here. So this is your chance to, you know, poke oh, your yeah. head out, you know Shinku, what I'm saying? Shinku uh, will be out of town. Yes. Shout out to him. Hope he does well this weekend at CEO Taku. But he will not be in attendance. He so will not those be. Nope. aiming for a shot at the Dragon Ball prize pool or cross tag won't have to worry about actually facing him this weekend. But we will have other killers in the midst. Yeah, agreed. And Space City Beatdown always just been just a, a wonderful, wonderful monthly that, you know, people from different regions in Texas, they come through, say hello. So hopefully we'll see a few of those uh, those big local names back on Saturday. And uh, we're going to move on from Saturday to Sunday. Sunday, it's, uh, it's, your, it's your salt, like... Day of rest, man. That's, <laughs> that's what it was made for. Yeah, this is where you come home and you go, man, I knew I could have hit that combo. What was going on? <laughs> <laughs> this is this is the day for y'all to relax. Is on Monday, we're going to pick it back up. What we got for him on Monday, dog? Monday, we're going to start off with uh, Bull and Bear. Now, VOA is still hosting out there uh, and doing this thing. However, they've started to also incorporate not only Tekken 7, but we got a few people from the community who actually bring out a super gun 
so you can play on Third Strike. And people who don't know what a super gun is, it's basically an arcade emulation of the game. It's purest form and way to play. Uh, people actually bring out equipment in order for you guys to be able to play it and get attuned to it. So, I mean, that, that's a special privilege that a lot of other TOs just do not provide. So if you haven't uh, if you haven't been out there, of course you'll get your you know standard Tekken Seven on, but you can also get some authentic Third Strike. For sure, and uh, if, for those of you who uh, happen to be on the other side and want to play some other Tekken Seven, we got Senpai's Cards and Anime. Man, it is a five dollar entry, and the first uh, people who bring in the setup uh, get. The human being's favorite word, free. You get, you get free uh, entry into the tournament for Tekken 7 Yo. if you bring a setup, man. And that's invaluable. It's easy. You pack your PlayStation in a backpack. And you just come up there and play. <laughs> and then you and play. And you come up there and play. It don't get no better. But it don't be you... too late, though, because they only do an X amount of people, I believe. Exactly. Yeah. The, the number is limited, man. So be sure that you, you, you're one of the first up there with a setup, man. And that's uh, at, on Monday, Senpai's Cards and Anime. But with that, that's uh, FGC for the week. You got big things happening from Tuesday all the way until Saturday with Monday. Getting a little time to cool off with a little retro game mm. and Tekken 7. So it's also good to see. Let's go. And I do believe we got some Smash stuff to cover. This is your domain, We right? do. We do have the Smash Brothers, man. We got the Smash Brothers starting on Thursday. Smash 4 at Coral Sword. Coral Sword, been the homie. Been letting us come through, play some games. Also good to see the the UH casuals and um, a couple of uh, other competitive players come through, see what Coral Sword's about for Smash 4. So that's always good to see. Casuals start at 7, and the bracket starts at 8. 5 venue, 5 entry. Y'all come through. Say hello for the Smash 4, boys. And, of course, for Melee, we got, Blue the, Bo Beetle, got boys. the Blue Beetle. The Blue Beetle Cafe doubles, $3, singles, $5. Doubles uh, at 6, singles at 7, but... If you uh, get some PR players out, yeah, I remember that uh, four four PR players come out, you automatically get a pot bonus. Yep, four play four PR melee players come out, get you a pot bonus over twenty five people. That too. Yeah. Over so you mean <laughs> to tell me that either four PR players can show up, it don't even matter the rest of the number, yeah, or just twenty five people. I'm, and there's automatically a pot bonus added. I'm telling you, a uh, melee pot bonus, just for, like, two simple conditions like that, it don't get no better. does not get no better. Especially for the price, too, man. I'm telling you, man. Ugh. That's some money to walk away with if I'm, you're ready. I'm telling you, man. So, Friday, we have the Go Weekly Happy Tea House. Hey, get you some nice drinks. And, of course, that Friday Night Smash action uh, hosted by the Go uh, long-standing tournament in Houston, so it's also nice to see that they're uh, running events, and that is a uh, very, very good practice for what comes next, Yo, which is Saturday. Saturday. Saturday, look, Super Smash Fight Club Four. This is our fourth edition of this. Wasn't the first one like in a house? The first one was in our house, <laughs> and now y'all boys are at the cannon. We we're, were at the cannon in boys, full we effect. Made it. We made it, man. Shout out to Mainline for uh, for hosting our events, and we're just really happy to be able to display, you know, our love for the Smash scene for the community, and it's gonna be dope, man. Super Smash Fight Club Four. We have it here at the Cannon this Saturday. Ten dollars venue, five dollars singles, and five dollars for players. Uh, if you want to do dubs, so look, man, we got national players coming out, right? So we have Ned flying down, boys. We got we flying down people, dog. We have Ned. We have J Band, who's coming back. Uh, he's a he's a Texas uh, legacy player. He's coming back. We have Biddy. We have uh, we have <laughs> Diablo. We got all these players, and of course. That man, Elegant, is coming back Wait, hold to on. try and Elegant get first. Elegant that won SoCal Regionals the, this He won SoCal Regionals. Well, y'all getting that boy to come down here, too. And he's coming back for some more. He's going to go for the double play here. Going to win SoCal Regionals. Going to try to win Super Smash Fight Club 4. I'm very excited. It's always stack brackets over there. Of course. and But also, if you're not a Super, if you happen to just not only like Super Smash Brothers, but you like a game called Pokin, Yo, you might want to come through for and that too. Gengar did just come off that national win a little while ago. Boy, yeah. I might bring out the Gengar too. You might have to come through for that, man. So, uh, Super Smash Fight Club Four, not only Smash Four, but we also have Pokemon. Shout out to the Pokemon community, always showing so much love. People who truly like love their hey, game, them love boys their go game. Hard. They go hard, man. Their community reps hard, and it's it's uh, a perfect pairing in my mind. Yeah. for you guys to have Smash and Pokemon. 
Definitely, definitely. Two uh two lovable love games by the community. So it's gonna be nice to see everybody just out in full force this Saturday at the Cannon, guys. Don't forget. And that is gonna be it for Smash this week. Sunday, Monday, you guys can chill. Monday you can come to OCM or you know, you can just relax, either or. But uh yeah, big things happening for the FGC side. Man, and Saturday the Smash is just popping. <laughs> Sat Saturday is the day. So no matter what you play, literally, no matter if you play an FGC title one of like the three or four or five and then the the smash side of things and poking so there's literally something to do all day saturday i can't wait for saturday Listen, i wish i could be at two places at one time well, yeah honestly if you if you feel like you can make that move and sign up for one tournament and drive to the other Yo, then that's yeah, heavy driving i mean across Houston. like go for it bro if you think you can make that move but man that is going to be it from us for the weekly bracket man next week we're going to be back in full force maybe share some results results with you guys but from all the tournaments man yeah, from all the tournaments definitely so that way you guys can not only know the weekly that are happening in your region, but also get to know some of the wonderful talent that we have as well. But uh, I'm Banjo. Yo, Chaos Overdrive. And we will see you guys next week.